Wagner. I used this when I was cleaning the house. I still upload that video. What do you mean cleaning the house? Like I did a um, like a montage or whatever you call it, like a speed. Oh, like a little vlog. Um, kind of noticed, cleaning like, the vlog or the house. It was like sped up. Why the fuck isn't this unscrewing? Cause you were capping, bro. This no, shit comes out of seven dude. Feet. This shit goes to seven feet, bro. I'm telling you. No way. Yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. I swear. What the fuck am I? Doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Am I doing it the wrong way? <laughs> You look crazy right now, bro. Like this? Ah, uh, there you go. Unscrew like that a little bit more, maybe? You think so? No? I don't know. Nah. Maybe. Know. Nah, nah. But no, it's supposed to be this. This is supposed to unscrew. There you go. I think it's that yeah, way. I think it just got loose. That's what she said. We were all loud, dude. We were loud as fuck. For real? <laughs> to people. Oh, shit! Yeah, you thought it was capping. You told me I saw seven foot? That's not seven foot. Damn! That's a hold on. <laughs> what is the angle looking like right now? It's all crooked right now, but that hat is sick, bro. Where'd you get that hat? At the mall. At the mall. Um, oh my god! Look at that stitching, bro. Sports promage. Let me hold it, bro. The stitching is nice. You, you think so? Yeah. Fuck yeah. I mean, you could like tell. Jeez. I just want to switch it up because usually I get like blue hats or like black hats. Or and, like, nuggets, like, type shit. Yeah. Like, keep this angle. You know what? Yeah. Hope not. There you go, Here Get ball first for sure on that one. That's a tree fall, bro. Don't listen to his bald ass. <laughs> Alright, so what's gonna happen? 
He just won that one in the world. And we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna do a three level score. So three spots, we're gonna do post work, mid range work, and then three point work. Uh, first three on every single one. And then after that, we're gonna go one on one. Yes sir. Yes sir. What are we going one on one to? Uh, we're gonna go one on one to 15. I would do a mid range now. First three points.
Three. Now we're doing three pointers. Same thing, first to three. I don't think you guys can see me. Anyway. Alright guys, we're gonna do five dribbles starting from the three-point line. And you can basically score however you want. First to three still. Alright, right, y'all. So I swept that. I won the posts, the mid range, and the threes. I'm gonna get ball first. Ones and twos to 15. Make a ticket at six. Go get it. 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 Go get it.
That's eight. Eight. What's he doing? Chat me up. Buy a bucket, cuz. I really thought I was going in. He get lucky. He get lucky as fuck. I guess. Oh, bro. You 
ain't getting no buckets. You ain't getting no bitches. Hello, sir. Good game out there. First of all, I want to say, how do you think the game should have gone? Hey man, I mean, it was a tough day, you know. Everybody has those days where they're just off. I was just off from three, you know. I feel like I should have won for sure. I mean, I was clamping him up too, you know. I was clamping him up. I was getting some stops, you know. I just couldn't buy a bucket. You know, give him his props, give him his credit, you know. But I know I'm better. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what? So, what part of the game of yours do you think you need to improve on after? Oh, for sure. This one on one. For sure, I need more confidence in my handles. You know, just shot making. But I mean, that just comes. You know, I was just off today. It happens. On the defensive end, how do you think you played? On the defensive Fuck. side. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, honestly, bro, you had me on a couple, on a couple drives, a couple post-ups too, where I was just like, you know, off balance and shit, you know. Hey man, it is what it is, you know. I thought I had a few good stops in there, but yeah, I definitely improved on the def defensive end as well. What did you think the final score was going to be? What the fuck? Yeah, I thought I was gonna win. That's an obvious question. I thought I was gonna be like 15. 15, 13, me. He beat me by what? 15, 11, something like that. It's 15, 12. 12, so you know, three points. I mean, I'll take it for as bad as I was shooting, you know. 
and I'll take it. I'll take it. You knew this would be a heavyweight matchup. Oh, for sure. Me and Chris go. We go way back since fucking high school, and we been having one v one since then. And it's always close when we play too. Competitive. You know, it gets feisty sometimes, but that's just basketball. You know. You know, he got lucky a little bit too. You know, this motherfucker be playing on this court since he was, I don't know, fucking jit, bro. Since I was young. Since he was a little jit, and, you know, obviously he had that home court advantage, the wind was playing in his favor, you know? The wind would stop when he had the ball, and shit would be blowing when I had it, you know? So, it's all good, you know? I ain't tripping. All right, Adrian, my last question before we get you out of here. When is the rematch? Rematch? Sheesh. Hey, let me get let me get a couple of workouts in the gym. You know, I was kind of off, off my game for like a week. I was I didn't play at all. I didn't shoot at all. So give me a week. Give me a week just to be in the gym. You know, work on my shot. You know, if we get about I don't know 50 likes, man. You know, yeah, 50 likes. You know, that should be a good good amount. And yeah, once we get 50 likes, you know, we're running back. We're gonna play rebounds this time. So this time, off miss, we can go for our own rebounds. We'll. We'll get more shot opportunities and more easier opportunities. All right, Ajo, we appreciate that. Good game by you. Yes, sir. And we'll hope we see you next time. Appreciate y'all. How you doing, sir? Doing well, doing Question well. right here. Chris the Abyss, Mr. Christopher Summers. How do you feel after that win today? Man, I feel like a million bucks, man. Ain't nothing in this world that can make me feel better than a fucking basketball dub. And you could, you could fucking ask a chat about that, man. I came out here, put everything on the line, made sure that he knew about it, too. I was holding nothing back behind this. What do you think of your competitor, the, the game, you know, the game itself? How did that go? My competitor knows all my moves. He's played against D2 athletes, D3 athletes, JUCO, NAIA. We go way back, man. We, we, we train together, so every time I do a crossover, that man sees it before I even see it coming. And he's a big body. He already knows that he could, he could hold his ground in the paint against me, against in the post. To even match up. Were you expecting for him to miss as many shots as he did? For him to miss that many shots? I got lucky, bro. Cause even if he made two of those, bro, that's a whole different game for me. Like I got, a, I got pressure on me at that point. I was playing lax, like I had no pressure on me. Imagine if the score was the other way, I'd probably be fucking shaking in my boots too, trying to jack those shots up. So it's all about situations. It's all about how the game flows. It's all about how it starts till the end. It's not just about, oh, it doesn't matter how you start. It's about how you end. No, it's about how you start till you end. Facts. Hey, oh, he's right. He's right. That was a good segment. <laughs> All right, keep going. Um, your opponent did mention that this is your home court. You said like you've been playing here for for quite a while. Um, did you feel like you had the home court advantage? Oh yeah, man. I've been coming here. It's my domain. This is my park, Sherwood, man. I miss this place. I mean, look at the scenery, bro. Look at the scenery. It's always nice out here. But I've been coming here since I was 10 years old. I'm 21 now. It's 11 Jeez. years back, bro. Ever since me. And my little brother, Jit, my little Jit of a brother, Trey Summers came. It's been 11 years. It's been 11 years since I've been hooping on here. So yeah, definitely home court advantage for me. One more question. While the game was going on, there seemed to be some viewers watching your game, you know, and they kind of felt like things were about to get out of control there for a sec. Does it usually get get like that between y'all two, or is it was that just a one-time thing, or? Oh, nah, nah, man. We always talk shit. We always argue on court. Uh, even in the gyms, like, I remember being at the Funplex and just like, there's like all the courts are literally full and we're in the middle court and like we're shouting so loud that other people who are playing fucking volleyball <laughs> are looking at us to see what we're saying. So like, no, it's always like this, man. It's always like this. Man, when you grow up in a ghetto ass town in Colorado, bro, that's how you play basketball, bro. You play, you grow up playing basketball knowing you might just get socked. Like, I don't know, that's just how it is here. I don't know if that's how it is from where y'all at. Comment down below where y'all from and how y'all play basketball one-on-one. -on -one. I really want to know. Facts, facts, But facts. yeah, no, that competitive fire, that competitive nature, that just comes with the game. One last question. Even though you did get the W today, um, do you feel like there's any aspects of your game that you definitely need to prove on, or do you feel content where you're at? Man, that is a pretty hard question because I feel like I was knocking on the shots I was supposed to. If I can get more consistent on the mid-range, like the spin, the post-spin mid-ranges and uh, the pull-up mid-ranges, I can be pretty lethal. But I think for sure, 100%, what I need to get better on is I need to get better on my vert. Because like your vertical will help you with jumping when it comes to the, going to the rack and when it comes to jump shots. Like I always get blocked on my jumps because I don't jump high enough. I think verticality is something I definitely need to work on for sure. During the game, there were some words said between y'all. It apparently seems like you said you get no buckets, and he said you get no bitches. Now, is that true, or what is the what is the deal on that? Man, no comment. Nah, uh, what the word is on that one is uh. Wow, uh, fuck, he gets no buckets. I don't know. Which worse? What's worse? What's worse? Fuck. <laughs> Man, honestly, I, th I think maybe getting no bitches is worse, man. Anybody can get a bucket, but if you can't get a bitch, hey, you can't even sing that song. You got 99 problems, but a bitch ain't one. <laughs>
So I, think, I think getting up bitches is way worse, so I'll give that one to him. I'll give that dub to him for sure. <laughs> All right, Christopher Summers, Chrissy Abyss, we appreciate y'all coming in today. Make sure y'all leave a like down below. We're trying to get 50 likes for the next rematch. 1v1 against my boy, Adriel. And we're doing the rebounds next time, man. You thought this one was intense. You thought this one got scrappy. Wait until the next one, man. Without further ado, we out. Peace, yes, sir. Peace, Yo, you slow on the court, and your car slow as fuck, too, bro. Adios.